Hi, you guys, and a welcome back. So I told you I recently sprung my ankle, and you guys' hearts has been making me get up and do more and stay motivated. So keep sending me hearts and will wishes and praying for me that my ankle will heal soon so we can do more deep cleaning and stuff like that. So this is my son's play area at my mom's house. So he doesn't like to clean, and I feel like this should be one of his chores to straighten up, to organize, to get everything back in order. So today I'm just going to be decluttering and getting rid of some of these toys. If you heard me say that, you guys, he will be so mad at me, um, but I will be using um just some of this homemade spray that i've used um it, which is just warm water oil and just a little bit of bleach <laughs> um and then uh, just a trash bag so let's get right into the video Oh my gosh, my son has so much stuff over here. I'm overwhelmed. Like, I just wanted to give up. But then I thought about it. I was like, no, I'm not going to give up. I'm going to get this stuff done. And I'm going to show my son, you can do this. We can both do this. We got to get through this. And you got to stop cluttering all of this. Like, he got old, like, children's place plastic bags over there with toys in it. And then he has, like, old mail bubble pop popper wrappers and stuff like that and old boxes that his trains came in I'm just like what the crap is really going on ridiculous like I just couldn't believe like all this stuff back here like this is so much like germs and allergens and everything like laying on the floor back here in the window and I'm just like oh my gosh I'm gonna have to do better at sweeping stuff up in his little play area at my mom's house like this is crazy handheld vac which I love it is by Black and Decker and I'm just gonna be vacuuming these little um, Ikea container things out I actually bought these at the thrift store for just a dollar ninety nine for both of these they are way cheaper than at Ikea and the thrift store that I go to basically carry all Ikea products so I am lucky to have a thrift store that has Ikea in, um, inside of it I guess <laughs> they have their own little thrifty ikea but yeah i just love getting ikea products because they last a whole lot longer hey sis i know you're loving this video today so don't forget to subscribe and hit that thumbs up button is never done and that is true your work is never done if you're a mom your work is never done you go to work full-time whether you're a stay-at-home mom or not you're still working I work full-time I'm a single parent and as soon as I get off work I have to go home clean and also cook dinner too so you have to make things work the way that you can make it work so if you have a busy day you got to stay motivated you got to keep drama and stress away from you and you just have to stay prayed up like I do okay and so today I just felt so good even though I have a messed up ankle I still decided to get up and stay motivated and 
continue doing what I love best, and that's decluttering and organizing my son's toy area and my mom's house. So I want to be a mom that lifts other moms up. And as well, if you want to lift me up, you can do that too as well in the comment section below. But I want to lift you up right now and let you know my mom always taught me if you ever have a child or she even taught me when I was little coming up as my son at six years old. If you have toys that I've never seen you play with or you don't play with and they just sit there. They are going to get donated or they're going to get trashed, especially if you're not playing with them. And if you play with them a lot and they break or something and you try to piece them back together, there's no way you're going to be able to keep them. So I just want to lift moms up and let them know that it's okay to declutter your kids' toys. It's okay to let them go. You can let them go. But we have to sit down and tell them, hey, why we let their toys go if they ask. Now, if they don't ask, girl, you better keep them moving. our dads let's just lift each other up okay just let me know in the comment section below it's like i feel like my son goes on to this plastic stuff like i'm not sure what's going on is it comfort or is it just because he's keeping all these extra toys in here because he does he knows that he doesn't have a lot of space in his toy area so he's trying to hold all his toys in these plastic bags so i won't see it so let me know in the comment section below like what is it? Why is he holding on to these plastic bags? this cleaning video today don't hesitate definitely drop that heart in the comment section below just letting me know that you are feeling this video and you possibly want more videos just like this So you guys, at this point, I am tired, I'm sweating, I'm over this, so I'm just going to wipe it down. I'm not going to even like deep, deep clean it. Um, at some point, I will get him a bigger toy dresser or chest um, at Ikea, but for now, we're going to let it do what it do, and we're going to work with what we got. <laughs> thank you in advance and just say I appreciate each and every one of you for leaving me a heart in the comment section below because it does keep the single mom motivated and keep me going keep me focused and sometimes sometimes my day do would be a little rough but you know what I come back to my channel and I look below and I see all the hearts and it just makes my day I just want to say thank you in advance for watching this video and I definitely will see you in the next vlog